Hi, I'm Nathan Thornberry with the Inspector Services Group, and I wanted to tell you personally about something I was made aware of this afternoon regarding the DevCon Security Home Inspection Program. Now, uh, many of you watching this video have been on the program for months now, and it's been going well for you. It's been going well for us, too. Uh, and frankly, it hasn't been going bad for DevCon, uh, but as I was made aware of this afternoon, it may very well be coming to a close, and you will likely get a notification giving you 30 days' notice as per your contract that you signed with them. Um, so first and foremost, you want to make sure that they abide by those terms and that you do, too. Make sure you have all of your leads delivered to them within that 30-day notice period. If you don't do that, you won't necessarily get paid for each lead. You won't necessarily get 90-day warranties for your clients from us. And uh, you won't get your recall checks paid for either. So you want to make sure that those gets in, get in. Uh, the other thing is, is that uh, you need to know that we are working with some of the, uh, we'll call them leadership members, of, uh, of various home inspection alarm groups and uh, you're going to hear some things coming out, out from our company uh, about what comes next. And let me tell you about a couple of them. Uh, we, as of this afternoon, led a couple of alarm companies that had been eager to work with you, uh, the inspectors that we work with, the inspectors that DevCon has worked with. They have been in contact with us and we've already secured uh, three states where we will have leads generated, delivered to that alarm company, and we'll be making some of those switches here within the next 15 to 20 days. The other thing we have is we have a major alarm company, uh, bigger than, I think they're bigger than Brinks ever was, and they're going to be starting a test with us, and that will cover more zip codes than the alarm inspection program has ever been in. Plus, we have another group that we're working with where we will likely run their call center operations, and that will expand the alarm program into new zip codes and provinces of Canada where it's never been before. We've been planning on making the alarm leads program bigger than it ever was. Many of you signed a contract with us and DevCon going into it. Some of you haven't, and those of you who haven't need to get in contact with us right away uh, and talk to Mike Dorr. Um, but you need to know this. You will have options. Many of you have been on these programs for a dozen years or more, and for some of you that are new to the program, here's what you need to know. Alarm companies have come and gone. Uh, Brinks detached from their armored car division and then eventually had to change their name into Broadview. ADT bought them and eventually turned, uh, turned their backs on the inspection industry when it came to their program and they shut it down, gave their 30 days notice. Uh, and DevCon got into it and their owners may not may lack the long-term vision necessary for this kind of program. Here's what is a constant. Throughout the program, throughout its history, the contracts that people ultimately sign for their alarm monitoring needs are worth money. And that hasn't changed at all. There's a line of alarm companies looking to work with the inspection industry. We have integrated ourselves with almost every alarm, uh, major software company in the industry, and we have thousands of home inspectors submitting leads through recallcheck.com. You're in the right place. You're in the right hands. Stay tuned for more messages coming soon. We're going to have other options for you within the 30-day period.